Webster County Public Health says a local clinic failed to report more than 3,000 negative coronavirus cases since the start of the pandemic. This skewed the positivity rate, forcing the Fort Dodge School District to scramble and change their school start date at the last minute. KCCI's Laura Terrell is live to explain how this all happened. Laura? Yeah, Rhea, the Fort Dodge School District had pushed back the school start date two weeks because of the county's high positivity rate, but now school is back on to start on August 25th. The last few days have been a whirlwind for Fort Dodge schools. On Friday, Webster County's positivity rate was higher than 20%, so the district decided to delay the start of school. So that we could get an extra incubation cycle to hopefully bring that positivity rate uh, down. But over the weekend, a bombshell dropped. Webster County Public Health discovered a local clinic wasn't reporting negative cases. More than 3,000 went unreported since March. We determined that with the accurate data, our positivity rate would actually drop clear down to about 10% or less. Um, that was a rate that we were certainly comfortable with in bringing students back to school. Webster County Public Health is not naming the local clinic, but in a press release says the clinic admitted to not entering all negative cases. Health officials started questioning it after realizing the county's positivity rate seemed too high. This is another wonderful example why local context and local control is so important. You know, we rely on Webster County Public Health. We have full faith in Webster County Public Health to help us make a good decision. Superintendent Ulrich was forced to do a 180 and tell parents school is back on next week. Even with the last minute scramble, he says parents are grateful for the now accurate data and information. We've had plenty of parents reach out to us uh, with positive messages about how excited they are that they get to have their kids come back to school. And to make things more complicated, Webster County Public Health says when that local clinic went to finally submit those negative cases to the state recording system, those numbers were rejected. So we reached out to the state to ask about this, but did not hear back before news time.